recording and we're in it bro i can hear you just yeah well so i so i try i was trying something new i don't know if you saw it david but basically um what i was doing was i was just streaming my desktop volume so i could have like an away screen and the away screen was just playing the uh rainy mood beneath the mask uh which is very very nice um and calming and i listen to it a lot josh does too uh but now that i'm here and ready to go we're getting right into the game only got time for an hour tonight because i gotta get to some work afterwards but it's fun now the question is is it working is everything working Bum. OBS, are you recording? Yeah, it's got it. Okay. Um, well, if the stream is bugging behind or anything, just uh, let me know. But otherwise... <laughs> Nicholas Cage, going back on the action. So, uh, welcome back, everyone who's watching. Uh, I've been playing through Persona 5 Strikers. I'm super excited for it. Uh, and we've already played through a decent chunk of it last night. Hmm. We also crashed the game last night, which was fun. Um, but today we're uh, I'm going to see how far I can get through. Uh, I'm assuming today it's going to be a lot of um, random getting to talk to the characters again. So let's hey. see. I think Tab is waiting on us. Hey. Alright, alright, I'll let let Futaba know. Hmm, I see. You do see. What? Oh. But how? I mean with this over here. There's no way that they made a sentient AI and Futaba's just a like I understand Futaba's gifted, but there's no way she's able to just read through the um through Sophie's code so Damn. easily. Damn! So that's it. No, that's not it. Otherwise, you'd be creating a sentient AI right now. So, what do you think, Fujaba? How Sophia's code look? While her programmer is a genius, no doubt about that. It's gonna be like Fujaba from the future came back and You can figure there. a person out by their code, not just their skill level. Their habits, thought processes, even their personalities are there. Interesting. This code is so advanced that even I can't read it and comprehend it right away. It'll take me weeks, even months, to actually grasp how Sophia works. Interesting. Let me... I'm just gonna refresh this page here, see where we're at. Hopefully it didn't crash all of Discord and everything. Take you months? Ooh, that's a serious program. I don't understand. Do you mean I'm impressive? Of course you're impressive, Sophia. Yeah, you're impressive. You're some kind of super AI. Super AI. I like the sound of that. Hold on. Just going to I'm just going to close everything that I possibly can that's not in need to be in use right now and see if that fixes everything. You should play Mitski. No, Josh, I'm not playing Mitski. All right. It looks like we're sort of here. I don't know. We're just let's just have fun with it. If you ever went public, everyone would call Emma old hat. <laughs> old hat? When something was popular at one point but stopped being popular, it becomes old hat. It's a saying people don't really use anymore. I wonder if Emma is uh in behind all this, you know, keeping Sophia down. Okay. I've got it. You are very knowledgeable, Futaba. She is. Don't go teaching her too much weird stuff, okay? She already learned well, all the internet. Did you see anything about Sophia's past? Her programmer's name? Or a company's, maybe? Uh, <sighs> no. Nothing yet. And most of those leave a signature of some sort in their work, too. <sighs> anyway, I'm gonna keep cracking at it from home. I'll let you know once I find anything new. Thanks, Futaba. 
second. Don't stay up too late, okay? I can walk you home. Uh, she she's gonna be fine without me, but uh, don't stay up too late, okay? Ah, <laughs> uh, cut me some slack. I'm in vacay mode. <laughs> Thank you. Well, folks, time for me to make like a tree. And the leaf. She made like a tree. <laughs> Oh, no one's gonna explain that to Sophia. We're just gonna be in the dark. That's funny. Boy, was that a hell of a day. That was a hell of a day. I never would have imagined something like this would happen. I just wanted to have some fun. I am gonna have fun, so... All I can do is get ready. Yep, that's right. If we went into this half-cocked, we'd be disgraces of phantom thieves. I feel like we're taking well, this pretty, the metaverse uh, reappearing may have been a surprise, tried. but even that doesn't compare with Sophia. Did you call for me? <laughs> God, S Siri, shut up for a second. We were just talking about how you're a huge mystery. Yes. Says the talking cat. <laughs> Got him. Uh, good point. Yeah. Wait, I don't have to take that from some mystery app. She's not an app. By the way, like how AI. does some top of the line program lose all its memory, huh? I mean, AI are supposed to be super smart, right? That is. inarguably true. Aw, don't get too down over it. I am humanity's companion. If I am not helpful, then I am useless. You're not useless. Sophia. Don't be so hard on yourself. At least you remember that much, right? Right. I think that means it's important. But is being helpful all you'll do to become a good companion? Is that not how it works? I'm just gonna check on the stream health real quick. It seems like everything is borked beyond unimaginable. Uh... Um... I don't understand what's happening. Is the... Stream going. God. It seems like everything is like really unstable. Let me just make sure no one's uh, messaging me on Discord. Ah, God. And now I have to re disable this. Uh, streaming's a fun time. Just restart this again. Wow, the stream is so far behind. What is happening? At least it looks like it's so far behind. Uh, can I maybe lower the frame rate or something? I don't know. I don't know. We're just gonna go with it. I, hopefully everything works out. Please explain. How else can one be a companion? Huh? Well, uh... Uh, that's, uh... I guess you just have to find a way to understand the human heart. Morgana couldn't. Come on. You can, you can own up and tell Sophia what this game is really about. We hearts? all know what we're here for. Yes, Sophia, hearts. Uh, right. Then you'll be able to empathize with other people and be a good companion to them. I True. guess. True. The human heart. Look, just, just don't worry about it. Is this going to be like the story of the Tin Man and Sophia wanting to like, get a heart? All you need to do is join us and learn from all the kinds of people we meet. In exchange, you lend a hand to the Phantom Thieves. So I guess you could call this a deal? More like a contract. Maybe. Okay. That is a decent deal. <laughs> Especially since it should help me become a good companion for humanity. Why does that keep crashing? It's very laggy. Yeah, that's what I figured. I don't know what's going on. It, it's probably just my internet tonight is being real, real bad. Um, I'll have to figure this out for another time. Hmm... This is so sad. That's what I get for... 
It only rendered the thing in 160p at max. I don't care about seeing my own thing. I just want to... Hopefully it figured, hopefully it fixes up. Yep. So long as it's good with our leader. Work that AI magic. Okay, I'll do that. Then it's a deal. Glad to have you on board, Sophia. We've got plenty of scouting to do tomorrow. We should get some rest. Okay. Good night, Morgana. Cage Queen. I like the normal music through this game. It's good. Why do we get to check out the jail together? All right. Great. Everyone's here. We're going to be infiltrating the jail. Are we ready? We're just going right in. Can we've we get done some this supplies many a time. and stuff? I can't imagine anyone being phased by this. Okay, I guess we're not getting any supplies. <laughs> yeah, bro. Bring it. We're very it's short on intel, bravado. so we need Futaba. to be cautious. We'll just scout the general area for this trip. We use Emma to enter, idea. right? Is there anything special we need to do? Um, no. We just opened the app and said the right keyword. Find the right name in Emma's search results, then enter the correct keyword on the friend request screen. Yeah, you got it, Futaba. Ah, leave it to the super hacker to explain this stuff. That had nothing to do with hacking. Even you should know how to explain it. I'm gonna I'm gonna try something real quick to fix up the stream issues. See if I can figure this out. Um, can I if I like remove my webcam? If I like deactivate that? I wonder if that'll fix up any of the issues. Uh, where is my cursor? There it is. It's my webcam's still going. Can I deactivate it? Deactivate. There we go. <laughs> Maybe if I'm not uploading two things of video, things will go better. Why does it keep saying? I don't know. I'm just gonna play through at this point. All that's left is to choose our point of entry. I agree. There will be no enemies in the area from which we escaped yesterday. Upon reaching the relevant location, you will only need to speak the keyword. Seems all that's left is to trust Sophia and see where she leads us. Now let's do this thing. Kinda got that TV vibe, like uh, for some four. It's good to see the whole gang back in action. Well, did we make it? <gasps> Your phantom thief attire. Yeah, you do. Oh, I've forgotten this feeling. Fusion of form and function. Truly magnificent. Thanks, Yusuke. Look, it's Beauty Thief! <laughs> the beauty My name thief. is Beauty Thief! No. <laughs> Let's not fool around here. I agree. I admit, though, these clothes do bring back some memories. Good memories? We can reminisce later. I definitely bring back good memories for you. Me. So, this is the jail? Just what is that building? This place is bonkers! Nothing escapes the atrocious color scheme of this place. <laughs> it looks like that because of someone's cognition, correct? Probably. Right. Most likely Alice's. The distortion has to be exceptionally strong there for a reason. So you're saying that's the stronghold of the Queen ruling over this jail? Its appearance certainly fits the notion. The buildings around here still look pretty normal, though. Looks like that place over there has a limited range of distortion. I wonder if that means we're gonna find like a safe room or something. Let's see. 
Oh, I'm gonna refresh this page again and see if it's still way behind. The first time we came here, we entered by the crossing down there. That's where we saw a group of cop shadows taking stuff out of people's chests. Diamonds. They were diamonds. Oh, you mean that jewel we saw? The hell was up with that? That may have been a desire. Yo, Phantom Thieves! Alright, so the stream is like completely not working right now. Uh, that sucks. This is just a straight-up internet issue. I'm not going to be able to do anything about this, unfortunately. So sad. Fascinating form you've taken. I can't stop staring at the beautiful. Maybe don't say lights. it like that, Yusuke. I've never seen an outfit like that. Can I try floofing it? Floofing? I think she wants to get a feel for the fabric of your clothes while hugging you, Sophia. Is that what floof? I've never heard of that before. Request denied. I am neither a child nor a pet. Thanks. Uh, no floofing. By the oh, way, how like does a dog. it work for an AI? Not right now. Sophia, how does age tell us more about AI? the desire you mentioned. Don't do, th don't do that to me, Yusuke. <laughs> that is the term used by shadows here. They say things such as, seize their desires, and we must offer these desires to the monarch. Based on their language and behavior, I speculate the aforementioned jewel was in fact a desire. That does make sense. When we saw Alice here, she mentioned desires too. So if Alice is the monarch, then she really is the ruler of this jail. But these desires, are they actually made up of the things people desire? Seizing desires of all things. What use would they have for those? Finding out what happened to the folks who got jumped could tell us something. Where could those victims be now? I don't see a place from here where they may be held. I don't know. Maybe they're being held somewhere else. Say, about those people you witnessed being attacked, are you sure they were humans? What do you mean? Well, couldn't they have been shadows or something? No, they were definitely humans. They got their freaking hearts ripped If out. there are humans getting captured and imprisoned in this jail right now, wouldn't there be a huge commotion in our world? Groups of people going missing out of the blue. No one seemed to care that Ryuji and I disappeared in the middle of... Uh, Shibuya 705. Now so. there's a point. I haven't heard a peep about that online. So no one is actually disappearing from reality? I, I mean. see. Shadows. What are shadows? A shadow's the parts of you suppressed within your subconscious. It's basically just your other self. Oh god, no, don't just admit that it's yourself. Don't don't try to deny it, otherwise everything goes horribly wrong. If Persona 4 has taught me anything. Does that mean their main selves are all right? No. Mm, probably The not. shadow and the actual self are two sides of the same coin. So if a desire is taken from someone's shadow, what happens to the person in reality? I gotta say, I'm getting a bad vibe from all this. Are they trying to influence reality by doing something to the shadows? Then how are we to act? This sounds like a crisis. Shouldn't we rescue the victims right away? No. That was just speculation. After all, we've only witnessed the cognitive world side of things. Until we find out how all this is affecting the real world, we can only know half of what's going on. 
I'd say the first thing we need to do is investigate Alice and her victims. Plus, if we make the wrong move in the cognitive world, there's a chance the ruler could have a shutdown in the real world. Right. We need to get the story straight before we make any real moves, or we'll just be doing damage. He's also gonna catch you some Z's. Uh, nope, not yet. Got it! Uh, but... what are we gonna do? Crashing some random store opening probably only works once. Let's say we get into that once we're out of here. Okay, let's get out of here. <sighs> oh, so we just came in for like two seconds and now we're leaving. Okay, well, no gameplay for tonight, probably then. of the jail. Next, we look into Alice and any potential victims. And how do we do that? Look into okay, what? I'm just gonna check real quick again, see what's going on with the stream. If David tells me it's still really bad, I'm just gonna kill the stream and I'll just record some stuff. See on Discord right now. Yeah, it still looks really bad. Let's see. Uh. Hmm. Anyway, I'm just gonna kill the stream. There's uh, it does not appear to be working. Through. And the good news, though, at least that means I can bring my camera back online. There I am again. All right, let's keep recording at least. Uh, and hopefully this should just refresh and be like, well, you're done. I killed it, though, didn't I? I am stopping. It still says stopping stream. Interesting. How do I... Can I kill the stream from Twitch's side? I could kill the stream from this side. Oh, it looks like it's dead now. Let's see if I go back and refresh it now. Yeah, now everything's. No, it's. Let's go back to Twitch. Am I. It still says streaming? Number one. Um. They really need to, I don't understand why it's so hard to get around this website to like find your stuff channel. Okay, so now it says I'm offline. Okay, I'm just gonna kill that. All right, let's just make sure, at least on the OBS side, things are still going. Yeah, looks good. Okay. Uh. Sure. Okay, let's just keep going. The usual rumor mills. Looking for anything about Alice? Gossip about her being abusive or other messed up stuff? Good idea. 
Let's gather any intel that we can, both online and on the streets. <sighs> I've got the web crawling covered. But if we're ever to gain conclusive proof of any rumors, I believe we'll need direct access to her at some point. Hey, I mean, I'm friends with her on Emma. Direct access to a pop star sounds awfully tough. Uh, uh, about that. I may get to meet Alice tomorrow. How's that, on? What? I mean, for real? How? She would, it makes sense that she'd be the one person here to be able to meet her. Well, I had harder. asked the modeling agency's president if I could meet her sometime. I heard she'd be on a TV show filming nearby, so I asked if I could visit the set. I was hoping to learn from her by watching her in action. I gave up on mm. it after making plans with you guys, but I might be able to get the ball rolling again in time. Let's go on. The timing's nothing short of kismet. It's kismet. Yeah, way to go, Lady Anne. Really fortuitous. But I'm not making any promises about it, and there's no way we'd get to approach her either. Plus, our full group's just too big. The most I could even ask to bring is just one more person. I wonder who that person's gonna be. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I think she volunteered. That. We're counting on you. All right, Cage Goods on it. That was shit when you made her so you can get some evidence out of her. Uh, I've got it covered. I'll figure Ooh, something out. You really are ready for this. Yeah. I think I'll tag along with you. We'll be fine so long as no one sees me. For today. Let's focus on her potential victims. Well, I'm interested to see where this story goes, because I wonder if there's going to be some go. overarching story of this. Looks like everyone's out of the Utah already. Let's not find it. There's so much gather from sources other than people. Well, the shots was here. Oh, is an investigation part. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Huh? Mm -hmm. oh, so hot out. You ever wonder where we have to drink? Our company sold fashion, forcing this businessman to wear suits. Okay, well that was worthless. Oh, here's the Puchiko mm -hmm. Satcho. Satcho of the loyal dog Puchiko. Dogs aren't human, but could they still be considered for men in this companion? What they are doesn't matter. The most important thing is trusting each other. Hmm. I'll do my best. That's pretty sweet. Let's see what else we got. I want pancakes. Where's Akechi? He's gotta be here somewhere. Only Akechi would say that. Uh, what's going on, Dad? Oh, come on. You're gonna be fine. Are you okay, Fatata? I thought you said school had gotten you used to crowds. I underestimated the summer vacation edition of Shibuya. The swarm of partiers is just too much for me. Uh, and even ignoring that, going up to people I don't know and eavesdropping on them or pumping them for intel is way out of my league. Yeah, I kind of probably shouldn't be comfortable with that either, but hey, I'm Joker, so it works for me. I'll take care of it. That's true. He's right. Leave this to us. You've got the online from lockdown for Taba. This should be helpful. I can lend you a hand for Taba. We can both lock down the online front. Ooh, thanks, Sophia. Time to join forces as a Cyber Sleuth Tag Team. Oh, yeah. Well, help however you'd like. Nice recruiting for Tom. Thanks! Thanks for talking to me, guys. I'm feeling a, lot, a little more comfortable out here now. Oh, hey, why don't you take this? It's yeah. probably not. May it aid you on your quest for intel. Hey, you got an SPA restored. Oh, yeah. Uh, what you up to, Yusuke? Interesting. It's more popular than I had imagined. Be able to avoid hearing people speak of her even if I wanted to. So, Alice in Wonderland. I admit it's an intriguing and visually striking space to work within as an artist. Thanks. Thank you for that, Yusuke. That was very helpful. Mm. Use the books, be us. Looks like there isn't anything to hear about the rumors around now, so we just have to go ask around. Alright. Um, let's go to Central Street. There's gotta be something on Central Street, right? Emma, list recommended choice. People, come on. We don't need to hey, go to the bookstore. I have so much. It's a shame we don't have time to read right now. I can't go to the bookstore? Oh, I like the bookstore. Uh, what about the beef bowl shop? Okay, can't go to the beef bowl shop. I guess we can hmm? interact with things. Uh, I don't have. Okay, let's get one of. We're gonna get one of everything. We're just going for it. 
gonna run out of money soon though if I keep doing that. Hello? Dude. I think I found something that was in the jail. When it comes to the alley behind the aerosol shop. Ooh, that's gonna be weird. Mm. Uh, yeah, I guess it would be what this is hot outside. Yeah. Of course On's near the creep shop. You're not really a creep person, are you? I want a creep. I want a creep. I keep hearing stories about relationships going south, even folks ending up hospitalized for exhaustion. And Alice's name always comes up. How is she not been exposed yet, then? <laughs> uh, could she really have something to do with all of it? But how? And why? Oh, yeah. I guess there's no point getting trust over it now. Oh, I know. Are you hungry? No good ideas in empty stuff, you know? I'm gonna grab a crepe and stuff. <laughs> and I'm not gonna be able to eat it, because we're kind of old. Extra chocolate and extra... Oh, that sounds so good. Oh, and maybe I'll have more strawberries. Just hearing them first I built. Really? And there's no reason not to go all out at this point. Let's throw a triple scoop of vanilla and the whole mixed berry. Uh, the mixed berry kind of ruins it for me, but I think chocolate is pretty good. I get some See you later. I'm gonna stay hydrated, okay? It's a hot one. Okay. Yeah, she's done. What about the gym? You can go around the gym. We need to focus on Alice for right now. Alright, fine. I'll get them gains hmm? another day. Hmm? Ooh, listen. No one could ever compare to you. I'll, I'll do anything. I'll buy you fancy jewelry, take it out to class restaurant. I'd set my life over to you if I could. Mm -hmm. Looks like so you can't even see us. I've heard of being crazy for someone. This is way too far. That was 23%. Okay. What about level headed girl? Alice? Of course I've heard of her. Everyone in class has. Especially the boys. They love her. My friend's boyfriend even went as far as breaking off their relationship, all because he took a sudden interest in us. Yikes. I know she's cute and all, but cute enough to leave somebody behind. Yikes. That was 6%. <sighs> I peeked into a store in 705 a few moments ago, and all the customers had that invitation card. Her number of friends is probably increasing as we speak. Big Bang Burger? How can I help you? <sighs> we can get Big Bang Burger. Hell yeah. Have you decided? Yeah, might as well. Have you decided? There you go. Have you just thank you? Uh, we don't get to do a Big Bang Burger challenge, though, in this game. Sad. This is a dedicated woman. Alice, is this an interview or something? Sorry, but I hate her guts. Go ask someone else. Alice is the type who toys with people's lives. She only cares about fans like pockets. That's two percent. I mean I could have assumed that, but you can't really ask her to trust her. Uh, arcade? Can we go in the arcade? It's so sh interesting and so shiny, of course Sophia likes the arcade. Won't get much information on it. I don't know, arcade be empty on a hot day. I feel like a lot of people will be here. Hi, welcome. Our buns are always fresh. That's a popular choice. Hot. Thank you. That all carry right. your items. I, that I all like hot buns. Your items. I like hot cross again. buns. Give me all your food, please. The pharmacy. Check it out. That's what you're getting. Thanks sure. for your business. I mean, that's I just kind of want to buy one of everything oh, right now, just so I can <laughs> have oh, one of everything. And come again. We'll see what we, like, need and actually need to use. I want to be just like Alice. Alright. That is ridiculous. Whoever ran the passage I said that. Hmm? <laughs> oh, here's the reference that everyone's talking about. It's Yakuza like a dragon. It's finally out. I can't just go by myself, though. Should I grab a couple <gasps> tickets? I, I see that blush. How long have you been there? I need the poster just caught my eyes all. Anyways, I heard quite a few plays at the theater were let go all of a sudden. The rumor is it's all because they weren't fans of Alice. <laughs> oh my god, there's hazing against people if they're not about Alice. Interesting. For such an absurd reason, I've got some going on behind the scenes. Exactly. I agree. It's pretty wild though. Wait, can I talk to her again? I'm going to ask her a little more about it. Uh, let me know when you're calling in a date. Okay. Love the theater. Not that we have time to watch a movie right now. Too bad. I would have liked to see Dragon like a Yakuza. Uh, let's see. Alright, so Ryuji told me to go meet him here. What's going on? Hey. Boy. Oh, that's the guy who got his desire stolen. Was, yeah, it yeah, was at Alice's thing. At first I thought he might be one of them. And yep, you know, he's thinking that kind of crazy. That dude in front of Bujigo is acting pretty much the same, right? No way that's a coincidence. Hmm? Alright, well, let's listen in. Come on, man. I need the money. Please. Again? I just let you money for all your owls obsessed bull. I don't uh, curse, by the way. Or I try not to curse. I'm curious. I just censored myself there. 
I know, but there's a new Alice original coming out, and I really, really need it. Like, I don't even be able to think or breathe if I don't get it. Dude. You gotta stop. The guy with the brown hair. I mean, they both have brown hair, don't they? The same guy we saw before, right? Dude, why are you suddenly obsessed over some random ass idol in the first place? Are you serious, though? You actually went to a loan shark? I can't believe you. So he's borrowing money from shady lenders only to get shady merchandise in return. That ain't normal. And didn't the other guy say he suddenly got obsessed? Could it be the influence of the metaverse? Probably. Oh, that was a lot of stuff. I heard some intriguing news. It seems there's a store on Central Street that carries clothing from Alice's brand. Perhaps we can gain some information there. Well, thank you for the heads up. If I go talk to you, do you have new information? May I have a word? You see. Not only that, out of all the people I saw going to stores that carry your products, most of them were dead-eyed men, and every single one of them left with armfuls of merchandise. Consistent binge purchasing like that can't be an everyday occurrence. Not wrong. Uh, wait, no. Where is the store? It's a clothing store, right? Where is the clothing store? Um, no. Where is the clothing store? Oh, wait, I missed the store over here. Are you ready to order? You'd like yeah. to, here's your order. Uh, You'd like to fix your waiting. You'd like to, here's your come again. Find anything useful? Yeah. Probably. If I remember to use it. Uh, clothing store, right? I need a clothing store, clothing store, clothing store. Clo oh, probably the, this one. Welcome, Alice Haragi. Oh, do you mean the Alice clothing line? Why, yes, we do carry it. But I'm so sorry, we're all sold out. We only put that up in the mount ten minutes ago, but the fans came in and swiped them all up. I'm so sorry that you missed it. Really? Wow, not in ten minutes. Yeah, that is, uh... It's like the uh, McRib every time it comes back or whatever. I guess it's possible, but those fans have some dedication to ride out so fast. Let's be sure to remember this. Oh, hey, that got me 200%. Cool. How's the information search going? Uh, why don't we meet up and share what we've gathered so far? What are you gonna do? Should we gather everyone up? I mean, why it's not? True. I don't think there's anything else we need to do, right? I hope not. So, uh, how'd it go? Uh, Anyone learn anything useful about potential victims? Yeah, we spotted a couple familiar faces. Worn out places. We found some of the people who were attacked in the jail. You really found them? Which means the ones ambushed in the jail were indeed only their shadows and not their human forms. Interesting. But wait, so does that mean when we got transported inside, we were only shadows? <laughs> There's still one thing. They're all acting real weird. Why weird were we able to actually go in then? They're all totally crazy for Alice. They're even getting loans so they can buy more shit at her store. That's pretty weird. Now that you mention it, I saw others behaving similarly in Shibuya. Yeah. Like this one couple nearly splitting up when the boyfriend bought everything Alice related he could find. There were even people let go from their jobs because they weren't Alice fans themselves. I've even found some reports of Alice fans straight up assaulting outspoken critics of hers. That's a crime. Someone should report that. <laughs> At first I figured Alice was just the latest fad, but this seems so much worse than that. And no one else has noticed. Maybe Only the people who us had the random group of teenagers. Them them went crazy. If that's I mean, the yes. case, then we have to do something. I agree. Agreed. If such aberrant Thanks, behavior too. continues to rise, we could easily find ourselves in an unwinnable position. With the metaverse involved, we're the only people who can stop this. Mm-hmm. We have to help. Let's do it. Hey, Sophia. It looks hey, like Sophia. you finished gathering intel on Alice's victims. It, Would yes, you like to have. investigate her next? Absolutely. Tomorrow is your time. Yep. Say, that's right. Let's break for today and pick this back up tomorrow okay. well, after they're gonna your trip. Force me to wait till tomorrow. Good luck with the Alice visit, you three. Thanks. We're on it. Hell yeah, we're bringing Morgana with us. At least we have someone to back us up. Oh, we're just skipping to the next day. We don't even get to. So this is gonna be interesting because I wonder how much freedom of exploration I'm gonna have to go around because it doesn't seem oh, like they're giving a whole lot. Oh, don't be Hello, too late coming Inspector. back. 
I mean, they have my face, so they definitely know that I'm here. But... He's just still mm. leaving. Boss, this curry is fantastic. <laughs> oh, thanks. He's already calling him boss. They're already on good terms, at least. A certain TV studio filming location. So this is going. It's the same line, TV huh? studio filming location as the other as the other game. I mean, they've got the assets. Why not reuse them? Even I'm starting to get a little nervous. You still good? Yeah, of course. Hey, I'm good. stay in the bag. If they find out we brought a pet in here, they'll kick us out. A pet? Yeah. Quiet on the set. <sighs> I guess if I can't be seen. Morgana should know about that. He you always has like a director chair too. in his uh in his uh cutscenes. We're fine. All we're gonna do is watch. Should I or also all out make attack, efforts I to say. blend in? Sophia, just shut up. Yeah. Just hang tight for a bit, Sophia. We're we'll no definitely gonna get thrown out of here for talking Ooh, to our phone. Here like she that. comes. Miss Alice on the set! That is some outfit. Holy crap. Oh, she really is adorable. <laughs> Running back from commercial. Back in five, four, three. three. And now, on to the hottest meet and greet segment of the show. We have a special guest with us today. She has taken the fashion world by storm and conquered it. Please welcome the designer, Alice Hiragi. Uh, thanks for having me. <laughs> Thank you for joining us, Alice. You sure have been keeping busy these days, haven't you? It's only thanks to all my fans that I've been able to do what I do. And what a number of fans you have. Talk about strong support. Am I wrong to presume that you designed the outfit you're wearing today? It's just so cute. Very expressive. <laughs> From the cute announcer. I like that. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much. The theme of my current line is Alice in Wonderland. <laughs> How, how, what genius did it take to come up with that? I feel like fashion is a rare and beautiful thing that can take anyone into a world built on their dreams. You can find a side to yourself that maybe you didn't even know you had. Fashion can do so much for us. Like steal people's designs? I try my hardest to focus on that whenever I design a new piece. Such wise words from a successful industry veteran. How old is Alice? What she inspiration originally spurred already? you into fashion design, if you don't mind? <laughs> to be honest, I was very shy growing up. I didn't have any friends at school. I would get so lonely. Aww. I wanted to change so much, but I just couldn't figure out how to do it. Then, one day, I saw the most beautiful dress in a shop window. When I put it on, the whole world felt new. It was like I was hit with this blinding ray of light. I really can change. That's what wearing it made me think. This is gonna suck when it turns out why she is evil, cause like, that's such a nice story. I mean, if you can afford the dress, that is. I strive each day to give that same feeling to every person who tries on one of my designs. I wanna give that ray of light to others. That's what inspired me to enter the fashion industry. Really? Huh. <laughs> now I can see why the young people love you so much. I do love the young people. How do you handle all the dating rumors? Why did he say that like that? <laughs> dating uh, rumors. Uh, what? Uh oh. What's happening? Uh, uh. Uh, dude, <laughs> you, um, you okay? Uh. Oh. Please don't like vomit out of shadow or something. What's going on? I don't get it. Is this some kind of scripted thing? I wonder what's wrong. <laughs> Are you okay? Uh, Alice. I. Oh, I love you, Alice. Please. Oh, boy. Spend your life with me. What? <laughs> Uh, hey! Why would you? What is all why this? Why would you even huh? want this as a person? Like this is so annoying. I would never want to deal with this. I didn't realize until now. I love you. Uh, this is really out of the blue. All right, stop it. I like our little <laughs> yeah, side eyes. Yeah, this is going though. on a little too long. Funny. I mean it. 
I can't live without you. All right, so this guy's about to get dragged off the set. What the hell? And what about me, asshole? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what about me, jerk? God, this is funny. Is this real? <laughs> Unfortunately, so. Those two were engaged already, right? Yes, they wow, were. Wow, what a train wreck! I can't believe this. I mean, obviously. Cut the commercial still doing. now! <laughs> You should have been cutting the commercial like 20 seconds ago, man. Dude. I'm begging you, Alice, please! Just shut up already! What has happened to you? What is this mess? <laughs> oh, she is. Ooh, that's evil. That's an evil look. No, we don't get to meet Alice. She can't steal our desires. That was scene. actually live on TV, right? Ooh, can't believe he spilled his beans like that. Even I thought he went overboard with it. So, then do you think that host had his desire taken by Alice? I mean, I can't know for sure, yeah, but obviously but we know it is. I sure can't think of any normal reason a TV host would do that. True. A sudden change of personality. It didn't seem like he was in his right frame of mind. Like he wasn't even there and someone else was controlling him. Morgana, that's it! I don't know if all this is right, but his personality changed like when someone's heart was stolen. God doesn't take a genius After to connect. The treasure? Maybe Alice can control anyone whose desire she steals. If the desire is turned over to the ruler, they wind up under their control. Like with Alice. I see. That would really explain it. It doesn't take a Amazing genius to figure always, this out. I mean, on it's kind of proof. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> but that would mean. I, I I love her, but. <laughs> she taking people's desires. Alice really is guilty. Yeah, looks like it. <laughs> Alice said she wants to be a ray of light for people. But only by first putting them into the darkness. That's what I've always wanted too. But on your your. I read better. about her in a magazine once, and I just really felt where she was coming from. It's why I asked to come to the show in the first place. I wanted to see her in person. But now, I wonder if that was all just. On you, you're gonna grow to be a much bigger star than Alice will be. Lady on. That was... Alice? <laughs> that was great, Alice. Quick, hide! Hide, Cage Kun. Miss Alice, this is a public hall. Please, you must keep your voice down. Eh, it's fine. See? No one in sight. Yeah, why would you ever... Alright, let's, let's hear the diabolical plan that she's going to explain to all of us. Except no one's actually listening. <laughs> anyway, though, did you see that lady's face? She totally lost it up there. All those cushy, talking head types make the best faces when things finally stop going their way. Miss Alice, do you think you could stop doing these things? Why is this guy not under her, her control? Huh? What do you mean? I was the victim on stage. <laughs> what is it that you want me to stop doing? I... I don't know how you're doing it, or why, but after seeing that... There has to be something. You... Oh! So you want me to punish you again? God, that is... A... That face. She's really cute, but... Ah, please! I'm sorry! <laughs> please don't take over... It's it's like WandaVision. They're like, yeah, get, get out of my head. Get out of my head. Oh. We're back to this motif. Oh, oops! What a terrible accident! Just like what happened on set, a terrible accident. I'm still upset over it too, you know. Isn't it your job to take my side? You said that a little harshly there, Alice. Or are you asking to end up broken like my last manager? Do you want to get stuck up in your room like he is? What's that mean? Uh. Well, it doesn't matter anyway. I don't want toys that don't do as they're told. Uh-oh. Stop! What's about to happen? Then beg me to forgive you until it hurts as much as you hurt me with your words. Why don't you do what you did yesterday? 
grovel with your beasts all messed up with snot. I'll take another video if you'd like. Oh, no. God, Alice, you're terrible. Come on, ben. Do it! Do it! I'm not gonna stop until you do, got it? She's like the worst e-girl ever. Hey, the guy sounds like he's in real pain. If she doesn't cut it out... Hey, stop! Uh-oh. And who is this? <laughs> Cut the sadistic crap. Piece of crap. It was way too far. You said you wanted to be a ray of light for people. How the hell does that help? Get her on. <laughs> oh, <laughs> we were just playing around. No, you weren't. Weren't we? No, you weren't. Yeah. It's okay. You can tell. So you'll go this. get the car now. Hey, wait! Hang on. Uh, are you on Takamaki? How does she know her name? Oh, frick. This is okay. This is gonna be bad. Uh, you know who I am? I like Morgana's like smiley face in the back, though. He's like, ah, I'm just here for the ride. Yeah, I know all the models. I read every fashion magazine the day it comes out. Actually, I really admire you. Would you like to be friends? I don't want to be friends with you, Alice. The last time I f was friends with you, it didn't really go well. <laughs> you obviously got Emma, right? <laughs> My keyword is... I just slap it out of her hand. Don't bother. I'd never accept someone who treats another person like that. Aww, too bad. But I do appreciate honesty. So are you going to give me some honesty now? So, how about you? Would you like to be friends? Good to know you don't remember me. Apologize to your manager first. Like I said, we were just playing around. Hmm. Hey, hang on. You were at 705 God damn it. the other day. I'm right. standard anime protagonist. How does she recognize my face? I mean, Joker's face is pretty good, but like... Ow. We're done here. Let's go. Let's go, cage coon. We're off to steal the Declaration of Independence. And then your heart, I think. Is her heart just the heart that's on her chest? <sighs> that's a bummer. Uh -oh. But I know I gave him one of my cards. Why doesn't he obey? Okay, so she's fully aware of what she's doing. This is messed up. And then I the plot stormed thickens. out and came back here. <sighs> Sorry about that, by the way. I was just so upset. No apology needed. You did a fantastic job finding out about Alice. Yeah. It's all thanks to you, Lady On. Once Lady On had her on the ropes, she whipped out her phone and tried adding them all on Emma right away. From what we saw, she might know that she can use Emma to lure people into her jail. She gets them into her jail, then takes their desires so they'll do what she says. I suspect she's been doing this for a while now. I see. That does explain things. But what is her end goal? I can't imagine such awful behavior actually doing her any good. I mean, people are just buying her stuff. That's She's making bank on it. Is it the same as with Kamoshida? That's a good point. Ugh, she seemed to be having a blast being such an awful person. That is true. Some people just kind of get off on that. Whatever it is, she has the gall to set up that kind of tragedy on live TV. She isn't in her right mind anymore. How the longer did she we leave this beat, steal the his more sire that directly up. on TV? That doesn't make sense. And it's already gotten to be quite a pile. Because she has to invite them to Emma. So did she invite him to Emma before the TV thing happened? Now's the time to act. But just how should we act? Is there a treasure in her jail? That's the tricky part. I am picking up a faint scent of something treasure-like. But what is a treasure? It's the condensed core of a ruler's desires. That's what gives birth to a palace and powers it. Usually, we just take the treasure to trigger a change of heart in our target. Hmm, that's interesting. What if there is no treasure there? Then we'll have to improvise. Maybe we just kill Alice. No, we can't kill Alice. We can't change Alice's heart. So For now, kill her. let's focus on tracking the treasure-like scent Morgana mentioned. That should at least put us on the trail for clues. I will say, if it turns out there's nothing I can actually steal in this game, then naming the protagonist uh, Cage-kun was a misplay. Question. 
Why must we change Alice's heart? Why? Because she's hurting people. So Alice only needs to be stopped. Changing her heart is unnecessary. Exactly, Sophia. Get the guns. No. Beating her shadow won't help. Worst case scenario, it could wind up causing her to die in the real world. I see that as an absolute myth. Death. That is an acceptable outcome. <laughs> Let's go, Sophia. <laughs> Companion Cube speaks the truth. Dude, that's... Hard. I'm humanity's companion. I'm supposed to determine the best choices for humanity. That's a little creepy, actually, though. I'm supposed to determine... This is very, uh... I don't want to say it because it's spoilers for Royal, but for the people who've played Royal, you know what that reminds you of. Alice Hiraki makes people suffer every day. We should ensure she stops this as soon as possible. I agree. Let's get the guns. Why not do so? So own up to her crimes, people can change. It's part of Phantom Thief code. People can change. I do not understand. I want to understand. But I cannot. Where is the flaw in my logic? People can change. That is a truth. You just have to look in, into yourself to decide how you want to change. I do see where you're change. coming from, Sophia. Alice is doing horrible things. We could just help all those people without caring what happens to her. The metaverse is serious. You can end a life without ever being endangered. I seem to always be endangered when I'm trying to end people's Even lives. still, we always choose to change uh, someone's heart music. instead of harming them. It's part of the Phantom Thieves code. Hell yeah. That's right. Kind of pointless if we gotta stoop to the bad guy's level to take him down. We never kill. We steal the desires of the wicked and make them change their ways. Exactly. Mm -hmm. That's why we're the Phantom Thieves of Hearts. Phantom Thieves of Hearts. Yeah, like your hair. I've got it. Hearts. Like your hair. I lack a heart. No, you That's got why it in I your hair. I don't understand the logic of the Phantom Thieves. So this really is going to be like a Tin Man story. We're going to have Sophia find a heart. If only I could understand how hearts work. If I did that, I could become an even better companion. Sophia? I've got it. I will join the Phantom Thieves. Let's go. I need to learn more about hearts so I can become an even better companion. May I join the Phantom Thieves? Hell if yeah. If I do so, I am certain I will witness many things about the human heart. Hopefully she doesn't end up becoming the final boss or something. I need to learn more about the heart. And about the Phantom Thieves. You're already one of us. Thank you. Thank you for joining, Sophia. Welcome to the Phantom Thieves. Glad to have you with us. Let's pick our code name next. Ooh, Ooh okay. now the nostalgia's blowing. <laughs> Mochi? Oh, please let me, please tell me it could be Mochi. Uh, it should be a bit sweeter than that. Oh, like marshmallow or blamage. I hate you, on. <laughs> Which is so names? cute, it's such How a simple name. Crocambouche. None of those make great code names or easy to yell. Mochi. What if we went along the same lines we used with Mona-chan? After all, we met her inside the metaverse the same way. What do you mean? Like, how about Sophie? I mean, sure, but... That's basically her name! <laughs> I agree with you. I like it. Alright, if she do? likes it, then I, it's I okay want to be me. Sophie. Then you'll be yes, Sophia in this world, and Sophie in the metaverse. I was gonna... Radical, I was wondering if dude. her name... Radical. Where is she? What site was she looking on in the internet to find these words? <laughs> Jeez. You're already more human-like than when we first met you. I am constantly learning things, thanks to the internet. Yeah, that and might learning be a mistake. Words as I speak. Stay off of Reddit. Don't pick up any off-putting lingo, okay? Yeah. Okay. She's gonna start so cursing like a sailor. It's like the Come Microsoft the bot mission. that went on Twitter and started like cursing like crazy and being like really racist. <laughs> We're going to stop Alice. Good. With this feels gun. like our duty, Not with a gun. considering we I became mean, phantom sure, thieves to help anyone suffering. I was one of those people once. We may not know the victims personally, but it would reflect on us poorly as phantom thieves to not lend a helping hand. As long as there are people in trouble out there, we won't, we won't turn, turn our turn backs, our backs on, them. on them. You're right. We are going to be the ray of light for everyone. That even includes Alice. 
Hell yeah. I have registered myself as a phantom thief. Let's go. I like her determined face. All right, the phantom thieves are back in action. Let's go. I can feel a strong bond with my friends. Ooh. Pass feel. After performing a baton pass, the showtime gauge will be triggered. It increases chance to trigger Harris in recovery. The bond feature has been unlocked. As fantasies deepen their bonds, they will acquire various bond skills. Bond skills can be purchased with bond points by navigating to bond. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> I'm saying bond a lot on the command menu. Um, bond points are acquired by raising your bond level. The bond level increases through socializing events in the real world, or by fighting battles in the metaverse. Our next step huh. is to make the proper preparations. Bond, bond, bond. The name's Bond. It's a fact that provision is prevention. We'll all need weapons and other supplies. Since you're the guy with all the connections, we'll leave the shopping to you like always. We'll get you ourselves ready. Me. Once you are too, just hit us up. So, is this how the deadline... I wonder if there's gonna be like a deadline hey. to do this stuff. There's what What do we say we start with the closest station head to Takemi Medical Clinic? Your medicine sure worked wonders for us before. I feel way more reassured if we took some time with... Uh, took some with us this time too. Well, unfortunately, we're going to end this tonight since I'm at an hour already. So, um, thanks everyone for watching, though. Um, yeah, sorry that the stream was really, really bad tonight. Um, but if you're watching this in the recording, um, let me know how I'm doing. Not that there was a lot of gameplay tonight. Uh, but appreciate you checking it out. And uh, have a great night, everyone.